Hey, how's it going everybody? Sick Eric back again with another video and today we're going to be taking a look at the new camera app for the Samsung One UI 2.0 Android 10 edition. So we're going to go ahead and jump into the camera app right here. Things sort of look the same a little bit. You have different uh, circle around each of the camera modes that you're shooting on. That way you can tell which one you're on. If you jump into your settings, you do have all the normal settings, seam optimizer, uh, your ability to change your resolution from full HD all the way up to UHD 60 and 30 and then your front facing camera as well you can change that to uh, 4K 30 I believe is the front facing camera option so you can still record up to 4K on here all your different settings right here uh, if you go into advanced recording you do have the option to switch on over to HDR 10 uh, that will only work if you have a resolution I believe of full HD if I'm not mistaken 60 frames no let's see yeah so it has to be I believe full HD at 30 frames per second oops let's change that back sorry guys so if we go to full HD we should be able to change that to HDR 10 right there so yeah all the different options they did change the icons a little bit as far as your uh, telephoto and your wide angle option you still swipe on down and it will give you your front facing camera as you can see right here and you do have the option of course for your floating shutter button and then you have the option for a wider uh, angle for your front facing camera and then your normal angle sort of crops it out up here up top you have your flash your timer your aspect ratio and your motion photo on or off now uh, where the night mode is at is going to be over here and like I said they have a little circle around each mode that way you can tell which one you're on if you go to more uh, right here is where you're going to find your night mode pro mode and panorama and food and if you want to customize these you go ahead and click on a little customization and you should be able to drag and drop that into the little area down there so if I want to drag and drop night mode and pro mode you can swap them around as well you just slide it on over to whichever section that you would want that on so I'll put night mode right there live focus and then you just go ahead and save and then you'll have all your different options right there to where you could uh, have them down here easily accessible so that's really really cool that you can customize that that way they sort of change the way that you customize it and of course you'll have your night mode right here and you are able to do night mode and telephoto uh, wide angle and your normal uh, camera as well so that's pretty cool as well for night mode and of course if you go into video you are able to shoot in all different uh, lenses as far as telephoto so say if I'm recording right here you're able to zoom in go into your normal crop and then go into wide angle all while recording so that is really really nice that they included that I wish OnePlus would have done something like that but yeah it's really cool that Samsung is still including all of that stuff into your device and if like I said if you want to switch cameras you could go ahead and switch around like that this is why you're in video mode or you could swipe down to go into that uh, if you want to go into your different modes of course you're still gonna have the swipe gestures to go into your different shooting modes like so so uh, with that being said guys, those are all the changes for the new camera app for Samsung One UI 2.0 Android 10 edition. Hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did. Thumbs down if you didn't. And that's quite alright. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that little notification bell for future notifications on my channel. Peace.